Hey, good morning, everybody. Mark again here, Weatherman Plus. It is Monday, December 7th, so God bless you all today. I hope you have a, a great start to your week today. Get out and enjoy your week because we got some nice weather coming, guys. As you can see, these are your temperatures so far this morning, so you're waking up to some pretty cold temperatures. Everybody except Miami and South Florida are still in the 60s and 70s, but I'm sure they're enjoying that. Now, we do have some snow that's fallen a little bit, and north uh, in Virginia, but it will be going by 9 o'clock this morning. We also got some storms that's going to brew through uh, Nassau, Bahamas this morning as it passes by Florida. Now, these storms are going to start around 8 o'clock this morning, and it's going to go through Nassau, Bahamas until about 2 o'clock is the last band. The heaviness will be gone by about 11, but there's still another band or two of rain that will go across uh, Nassau, Bahamas to about 2 o'clock, and then it's going to dissipate. South Carolina, you still got your rain until about 5 o'clock this afternoon. Let me show you that real quick, because after that, guys, we literally have nothing for a while, which is good to hear. Now, South Carolina, North Carolina, to about 7 o'clock this morning, you still got some rain going. It's going to move out about 8.30. Uh, but you also have some rain that's moving through for South Carolina right around noontime. Now, this won't be severe and really bad, uh, but it will be some storms. You can see the red and yellows. It will be across all the way to about 6 o'clock this evening. So it will be uh, patchy. It will be in only some spots. But then again, that will be it. Now, let me show you exactly what you have going for the next two and a half days, guys. And I actually think that that's a good thing because after hurricane season, not only does everybody need a break, but literally... We are getting a big break. As you see the rain moving out this morning, it'll be about 10 o'clock and it'll be across everywhere except for the Bahamas, what I showed. In about two and a half days, we're going to get a little bit of weather in Michigan. There'll be some rain and freezing rain. And then after that, we're going to start getting some snow coming in from Washington. But if you keep watching, you will see that there is nothing. I mean, the time and date is on the left. This is 7 o'clock tonight. We are literally empty of weather, y'all. That is a great thing because not only do y'all need a break, I'm sure everybody else needs a break as well because all I see is people asking for winter thoughts on their videos. It's like, yep, there's no weather to report. So that's a good thing. So bless you all. Have a blessed day. Have a blessed couple of days because we have no weather. So get out there. Have a good time, guys, really. Now, yesterday we did Matthew 16. I like to go over Matthew 17. And after six days, Jesus taketh Peter, James, and John, his brother, and bringeth them up into an high mountain apart, and was transfigured before them. And his face did shine as the sun, and his raiment was white as the light. And behold, there appeared unto them Moses and Elias, and talking with them. Then answered Peter and said unto Jesus, Lord, it is good for us to be here. If thou wilt, let us make here... Let us make here three tabernacles, one for thee, and one for Moses, and one for Eliza. While he yet spake, behold, a bright cloud overshadowed them, and behold, a voice out of the cloud which said, This is my beloved Son, in whom I am well pleased. Hear ye him. And when the disciples heard it, they fell on their face and were sore afraid. And Jesus came and touched them and said, Arise, and be not afraid. And when they had lifted up their eyes, they saw no man save Jesus only. And as they came down from the mountain, Jesus charged them, saying, Tell the vision to no man, until the Son of Man be risen again from the dead. And his disciples asked him, saying, Why then say the scribes that Elias must first come? And Jesus answered and said unto them, Elias Truly shall first come and restore all things. But I say unto you that Elias is come already, and they already knew him not. But have, have, but have done unto him whatsoever they, they listed. Likewise shall also the Son of Man suffer of them. Then the disciples understood that he spake unto them of John the Baptist. And when they were come to the multitude, they came to him a certain man kneeling down to him and saying, Lord, have mercy on my son, 
for he is lunatic and sore vexed. For oft times he falleth into the fire and oft into 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 the water. And I brought him to the, thy disciples, and they could not cure him. Then Jesus answered and said, O faithless and per perverse generation, how long shall I be with you? How long shall I suffer you? Bring him hither to me. And Jesus rebuked the devil and departed out of him, and the child was, was cured from that very hour. Then came the, the disciples to Jesus apart and said, Why could, why could not we ha have cast him out? And Jesus said unto them, Because of your unbelief, for verily I say unto you, If ye have faith as a grain of mustard seed, ye shall say unto this mountain, Remove hence to yonder place, and it shall remove, and nothing shall be impossible unto you. Howbeit this kind goeth not out, out but, but by prayer and fasting. And while they abode in Galilee, Jesus said unto them, The Son of Man shall be betrayed into the hands of men, and they shall kill him. And the third day he shall be raised again, and they were exceeding sorry. And when they were come to Capernaum, they that received tribute, money came to Peter, and said, Doeth not your master pay tribute? He saith, Yes. And when he was come into the house, Jesus prevented him, saying, What thinkest thou, Simon? Of whom do the kings of the earth take, take custom or tribute? Of their own children or of strangers? Peter saith unto him, Of strangers. Jesus saith unto him, Then are the children free? Notwithstanding, lest we should offend them, go thou to the sea, and cast an hook, and take up the fish that first cometh up, and when thou hast opened his mouth, thou shalt find a piece of money. Take that, that take, and give unto them for me and for thee. Amen. God bless you all today, guys. Hope you all have a great day. See, the rain's coming with some freezing rain, and this is all the way on the 9th, and then it's going to pass to the northeast. It's just a little bit of rain, and we got some coming in in uh, Washington. It's going to be not much for the next couple of days, and that's a beautiful thing. If look at it. We have literally <laughs> nothing going on except in upper Michigan on the 8th, and then some in the west coast on the 9th. So it's a great day. It's beautiful if you ask me. We have nothing going on for a couple of days. And it's been already a couple of days of that. So in my opinion, this can keep on coming like that. Because I like the clear weather. It gives us more time to go out and do things that we need to get done. So God bless you all today. Hope you all have a great day. All glory does go to God. Amen.